Did you notice that when we play back our movie, it looks like someone has placed a few cameras in the scene and is switching between them? That's some artificial intelligence working for you. It does a great job, really. But what if you want to take a bit more control over your movie? Well, you can! The first thing we need to do is to turn off the automatic cinematographer. Now, when we play back our movie, the same camera stays active throughout. It was a pleasure. You can change the camera for another, like so. Thanks, honey. You did a great job. But that's still pretty boring. A better way is to add markers in the dialogue to specify when we want to change the camera. So let's drag the camera marker into the first line of dialogue, like so. And choose this camera. You can place those markers anywhere within the dialogue. Let's add another camera change here. Thanks, honey. You did a great job. This works, but the second camera changes a bit too late for my taste. By dragging the camera marker to the left, it'll happen sooner. You can also add camera markers by dragging one camera marker directly into the dialog. Let's see what we have. Thanks, honey. You did a great job. It was a pleasure. Will you do the garage now? Awesome! Now, let's customize the actor's movements. We can drag a gesture marker into the dialogue, just like we did for the cameras. There's a lot to choose from. I'll try Wonderful. Notice that the actress is kind enough to preview the gestures for us. Thanks, honey. You did a great job. It was a pleasure. Will you do the garage now? Okay, great. Now, let's finish our movie by having the actor react. He can't be happy about what you just said, so we'll add a new dialogue line and drag in a facial expression marker. We can change the current camera to see the animation preview better. This gust is just right. To see his reaction, we can add a close-up on him. Let's see. Will you do the garage now? Hmm, almost there. If you could just look at the camera during the last shot, it would be perfect. Thanks, honey. You did a great job. It was a pleasure. Will you do the garage now? Yes, excellent. Now, let me show you one more thing you can customize. These three pictures on the fridge are swappable screens. You'll find them here. To replace any of them, you need to add a new picture to the project. Once added, you can drag it on top of the screen to do the swap. Looks great! And, by the way, you can also add ambient sounds the same way. There's even a long list of pre-recorded sound effects and music cues for you here. Thanks, honey. You did a great job. It was a pleasure. Will you do the garage now? That's it for now. Have fun making your next movie!